It's not a rising again web 3748. It's just whenever I see Jason say something that's just so appallingly um, self-serving, I, you know, he said, he said a couple of things yesterday on Twitter and I just couldn't let him pass, you know. He said, uh, what did he say? Well, it's okay because I asked Leo to be on the uh, website. I said, you could, you know, you, you could put your, your show on the Twist site, on the This Weekend site. And so I, I tweeted, yeah, that's kind of like the wolf saying, hey, it's okay because I told Little Red Riding Hood she could have a place to sleep. It's not, you know, doesn't make it okay. And then he's saying a rising tide, you know, we're, we're making Leo more successful. That's a lie, actually. What they're really doing is they're hurting my business by causing... Uh, creating confusion between my content and theirs. Um, but on the other hand, I don't want to give Jason any more publicity. So I'm just kind of, you know, I'm not, you're not going to hear me talk about it, but if he says something that's just appallingly insulting, I'm going to just, you know, gently say, hey, yeah, that's right, Jason. Sure. Yeah. You're helping me by, by confusing people about who's who. Yeah. I know nobody cares and that's why I really, I should just shut up about it. But, there are some people who, who might believe him, and I just don't. I want to make sure they don't believe him. You know, he knows what he's doing. He's not an idiot. And, he, and then he tweets, and "I'm sure I'll be on Twitter again real soon." Yeah, in your dreams. You're never gonna be on Twitter again, dude. Might as well face the face the reality. You know, it's, well, it's sad because I really like Jason, and I did trust him, and I gave him a lot of uh, credit and so forth, and he just. You know, stab me in the back. So what am I going to do? That's life. It happens all the time. It's called business. You know, we were helping him build a skype and all sorts of stuff. And it's like, yeah, I guess not. I guess that was a mistake. I, wouldn't, I don't have a problem with Revision 3. I don't have a problem with somebody who's doing something in the same space as me. That's fine. But to take my name... <laughs> And then to tell sponsors, you know, not to tell sponsors clearly that, that it's a different company is like pretty blatant. By permission, he said, uh, can I do This Week in Startups? I said, yeah, sure. But he didn't tell me he was going to launch a network named This Week In. <laughs> that was, it's like give him an inch, he'll take a mile. Uh, now, J what Jason's whole strategy was to basically leverage his way into a merger with me. And by doing so, uh, capitalize on the value of my company without actually adding any value of his own. Because his company, I mean, his show is basically crap. So, but he thinks, I think by naming it the same thing that I will eventually have no choice but to merge. <laughs> that's, bit, that's the only thing I could figure out. That's why I keep saying things like, well, we'll just do a daily show. Together. It's like, no, Jason, I'm not going to do anything with you. You can stew in your own juice. <laughs> 